Hello, what's up, guys? <laughs> this is Danny with Shenzhen.org. Today, I'm going to be showing you how I set up my Hapog HD PVR to record PC footage. I got it for about $200. No, I got it for $249.99 at Amazon.com. It's probably one of the best investments I've made. It records great quality footage at 1080i. So, let's get started. Alright, so first things first. I have a GeForce GTX 260. There's this um, HDTV to component cable adapter that came with the car, free of charge. Um, well, yeah, basically it should come with your video card. So use this to jack into your HDTV port. I'm not sure if you can see it, but I have two DVI ports and one HDTV port on the right side. It looks like a S video port, but it's actually not. So don't be mistaken. This goes into the HDTV port on your video card. Then what you do is you plug in the component cables coming from the HDPVR. These cables are included with the actual product. So plug in the corresponding jacks. Then this goes directly into, as you can see, the in ports. So that goes into there. For our sound, what I have is, I have an audio splitter that I bought somewhere. One goes to my speakers, and one is another splitter. It's a stereo to RCA splitter and this one so this audio splitter splits the audio signal so the audio signal goes through to my stereo to RCA which plugs into the HDPVR ends so so next step is um, I just have my USB hooked up to my MacBook as you can see I use a software called HTPVR Capture it's a brilliant program it has lots of features like I could adjust constant bitrate variable bitrate record well the software lets you record up to 25 um, kilobits per second just like 20 megabits per second it's a lot but I don't think the actual hardware can record past 13.5 but anyways you can choose to boost audio levels you can have AAC or AC3 you can even have it convert to a different video format anyways um I'll show you guys a demo of me recording some footage alright so on Windows go to screen resolution and you basically have it clone the HDTV input output. So I'm gonna redo this like it was, it's new. All right, so right now I got dual monitors, right? The HDPVR has no output right now. So number three is my HDPVR. So what I do is I just disconnect this display. Then I click on my main monitor and just duplicate this desktop on one and three. And voila, it should clone your monitor. As you can see, the um, a resolution is 1680 by 1050, which is um, six, ratio is 1610. And it's not normal, but. Um, the HDP would will capture it as 1080p so it can get the whole resolution. Still looks great. So, if you go over here, the MacBook. I already set up everything. Component, video input, rear, analog, RCA jacks. And the reaching time, one hour and three minutes. I can stop anytime I want. So let's record it. So as you can see, it's recording. At um, it's recording at like 13 ish, 
12. So let's load up a game. Right now it's capturing everything on my monitor. So let's try Batman. Great game by the way. Yeah, so let me press some buttons here. Alright, let's check it out. I stopped the recording. Go to my... Go to the place where I saved it. And what do you know? There it is. Just, uh, just a note, my laptop isn't actually fast enough to play back the large files, but that's okay because I just transfer it to my main computer where I edit it for uploading and stuff. But yeah, your laptop doesn't need to be powerful, it just needs to, you know, be there to store all the information from the video card. And that's basically it. If you have questions, leave a comment. And I'll see you later.